Hey yo guys, it's me, KDB349, and I'm just going to be talking about the new NXT. Now, NXT was epic last week. It was the best NXT I've seen in a long time. Um, and I am so glad that NXT opened up with the Divas match. The Divas match was with Sophia Cortez against Paige. Now, I love those two divas. Those two divas were epic. They, those were awesome divas. Those were two of the greatest divas I've seen in a while. That was the best divas match I've seen in a long time. I mean, a long, long time. Because as we all know, the WWE doesn't give a damn about its divas. But that match between Sofia Cortez and Paige on NXT last week was sick. I mean, that that wicked DDT Sofia hit on Paige was just, it was epic. That looked it like, that looked it painful. I would have hated to be Paige <laughs> at that moment. Got hit with that, um, that monster DDT. Those two divas on NXT right there, they deserve to be on Raw or SmackDown because clearly those divas are talented. The WWE needs to stop being so stupid and bring some real divas back into the divas division because there's not one freaking active diva, not counting AJ, there's not one freaking active diva in the WWE right now. I mean, the only freaking Divas match I've seen on Raw or SmackDown was AJ versus freaking Vicky Guerrero. And I don't even care about Vicky Guerrero. I can't stand Vicky Guerrero. And AJ, she's a bit unstable. So, I would love to see a Diva like Sofia Cortez or Paige on SmackDown. Because those, those two Divas, they really have the fire. They have the, the ruthless aggression inside of them. And I think that would be good to put either Sophia or Paige on Raw or SmackDown because their match on NXT was hated. The best Divas match I've seen in a long, long time. And that's what the Divas matches needs to be like. Epic. Great. It needs to have ruthless aggression. That's something that can save the Divas division. The WWE needs to stop bitching around with Sam Punk and AJ and Daniel Bryan and focus on the Divas division. Because the Divas division has already went so far down the drain that I don't even know if you could save them anymore. But after I saw that match, that one match, I started to get back in the Divas division. Get out of my room. Get out of my room! Go! No, I like that was saying. After six... No, stop it! No, like I was saying, I started to get, I started to regain hope back into the Divas division after seeing that match between Sophia and Paige. Those two Divas right there are the type of Divas that needs to be involved on SmackDown and Raw. They deserve to be on TV. And now... If the WWE was smart, they would recruit more divas like Sophia and Paige and bring them to Raw and SmackDown. So that way, us divas, us diva fans, can get what we want. We can finally see a real divas match. I'm not talking about Beth Phoenix versus Kelly Kelly. I'm not talking about a squash match between Karma or whoever, whoever she's gonna fight if she returns. I'm talking about a real Divas match. I want no lame 30 second tag team Divas match. A real Divas match. A 
seven or eight minute freaking Divas match. That's what I want. I'm pretty sure that's what all the Divas fans want. And that that's what the WWE needs to do. That that's exactly what the WWE needs to do. They need to revamp the Divas division. They need to bring back the Divas division. Put it back on its pedestal. Bring it back up to the high level it was once at. Anyway, that's all I wanted to say, and I'll see y'all tomorrow. If I don't, I guess I'll talk to y'all next week, alright? Subscribe.